when we write after effects expressions so we can use javascript maths to do a lot of cool things let's go to the after effects and see how to do it here you can see i have created a text layer so you can expand the text layer and you can expand this uh, source text option for this one i type the expression random i type the random and let's say 50. if you don't know about this expression i have created a video previously please watch that now uh, this will generate uh, random numbers between 0 and 50 like this right uh, now uh, you can see it is uh, extra decimal points uh, it created now now we are going to use the javascript uh, math uh, function uh, to round these numbers uh, round up or round down so uh, first uh, before i apply the javascript uh, math uh, i need to create a variable so i add a variable called a to this one and equal random that means uh, when the after effects look at the what is the text of this layer it look at the a variable and we add a function to a variable uh, random 50 right so now a variable is uh, generating random numbers uh, between 0 and 50 now uh, for the second line uh, you can go to the expression menu by clicking on this arrow here you can see option javascript math using uh, javascript math uh, we can do a lot of uh, cool things uh, but in this case i just uh, wanted to demonstrate the math round function here you can see math round and uh, we click on this and it will this at apply the math dot round uh, function and for the value uh, we type the a variable right now it is rounding up or rounding down the uh, value of the a variable now when you apply this expression now it is uh, generating rounded numbers like this it is generating random numbers between uh, 0 and 50 and using the math round function it, it is uh, rounding up the numbers rounding up or rounding down right uh, based on the decimal point right so this is uh, how you use the javascript uh, math there are some other options like if you want to apply uh, uh, source text uh, let's say you want to apply another option like javascript math then for the source text so uh, you can apply the value of a pi you can see math pi option like this and it is the value of the pi for the source text there are some cool ticks uh, with the javascript uh, expressions uh, more tutorials uh, coming in the future all right guys that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching the video if you haven't subscribed to anti vfx please subscribe to anti vfx uh, you can learn a lot of uh, cool things uh, in this channel. You can support the channel. I'll be back with the next uh, video. Thanks.